the villages have been under siege for years by Sunni Islamist rebels in Idlib province in the last major insurgent-held part of Syria. Assad, who is advancing against rebels in the southwest, has vowed to recover the entire country. Some 7,000 people are due to leave both villages, said Almana TV, run by Lebanon's Shiite Hezbollah movement. Population transfers have been a common feature of the seven-year Syrian war, mostly at the expense of Assad's opponents. The conflict has killed an estimated half a million people and driven some 11 million from their homes. Rebels and civilians have been bussed out of their hometowns to insurgent territory in the north, as government forces advanced with critical help from Russia and Iran. The opposition has decried it as a systematic policy of forcible displacement against those opposed to Assad, who comes from the Alawite sect, an offshoot of Shiite Islam. The conflict took on a sectarian dimension as it swelled out of protests against Assad's rule in 2011. Shiite Islamist militias backed by Iran have deployed from across the region to help Damascus against rebels, many of whom identified themselves as Sunni Islamists. The pro-Assad commander and an Islamist rebel source familiar with the secret talks said separately that Turkey was also involved in the process, which builds on a deal from last year that had not been fully implemented. State TV said 121 buses had entered Alfwa and Kefreya in Idlib province so far on Wednesday, along with Syrian Arab Red Crescent, SARC, ambulances for sick residents. The evacuees will include a lot hostages that rebel factions took when they overran Idlib more than three years ago, it said. In exchange, hundreds of residents left two towns at the border with Lebanon, Madea and Zabadani, which were in the hands of Sunni rebels at the time and under siege from pro-government forces. They were moved to Idlib. But other parts of the deal, evacuating the people remaining in Alfwa and Kefreya and releasing 1,500 detainees from state prisons, did not go through at the time.